That's how it is. Nothing here at all. What did you expect? Headstones, a flag, and flowers? No. I... I don't know. A marker. Something. Anything. We'll figure something out. Better now? A bit. But let's say it was my real grave. What would you write? Here lies Johnny Silverhand. The guy who saved my life. V, you don't know how much I want that to be true. Listen, I realize I fucked up a lot of things. Either let down or used every last person who gave me their trust. Blind, selfish bastard that I was. But I've managed one thing for now. Not to fuck this up. What we have. No, Johnny, you fucked that up too. You used me. You lied to me. I can't trust you at all. <clears throat> Is it too late to ask for a second chance? What do you want from me? Most people I thought were my friends. They couldn't even stand to be in the same room with me. You're fucking closest to me by a long shot. There, 24-7. And yet, you don't seem to hate my living guts. At least so it seemed. Till now. Okay. But as second chances go, this is your last. I refuse to be that naive. I'll try damned hard. Johnny Silverhand, relentless rocker boy who never gives up. V. First among suckers. You were a real dickwipe at first. You sorta of deserved it. Remember waking up at Victor's not knowing about me? I'm seeing things. I'm scared. Then moaning at Misty's about how you didn't want to die. Remember you whining for smokes in the middle of the night? Complaining about not being able to kill me? Never thought we'd make it this far. When you said you let your friends down, did you mean Rogue? Rogue, Alt, Carry, Santiago. Not all's lost yet. At least with Rogue. Can't pretend nothing's changed over 50 years. Can't just insert myself into her life. Smasher Biz really got to her. You can't leave it like this. I don't think. Might be right. She was acting weird. You ought to talk to her. You know, did promise her I'd take her to the movies long, long ago. Good idea. Call her for me? Ask if she's free some night? Thing is, you'd have to surrender control. Again. Yeah. I'll call her. Okay. That's Delta. Nothing to see here after all. Worth coming out all the same? Absolutely. Thanks, V. Of all the heads I could have popped up in, hella glad it was yours. Tell you once we're there.
Movie was a turd wrapped in crepe paper. Oh. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, I'm still here. For now. You know, you should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. style goodbyes you do you come a long way to get here haven't we just think it all started in a fucking landfill mm -hmm. then you tried to kill me see exactly what i mean trying to save your sorry hide now you can let me do that or you can try pan am and her tarmac rats but then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. Think you ought to go with Roke. Two of you together got the best shot. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. You're up, Johnny. I trust you. Take the wheel. Just, uh, go easy on us, yeah? Thanks, V. I'll get us through this. You'll see. See you on the other side. That's right. Even if I gotta burn this whole fucking city down. Look who we have here. Just like that. Ghost. Don't you hear this thing go? What? Waiting. Hey there, V. Drop in for one last drink before turning in. I'll put it to you this way, Wakako. You're running your little operation only because I have allowed it. And I can change my mind whenever I want. Hang on, give me a sec. V? V's taking a break. It's me. We'll talk soon, Wakako. What do you want, Johnny? Jesus, who died? Not happy to see me? Frankly, I'm not sure. Why? We had fun at the movies, didn't we? We're not at the movies anymore. Plus, got a good idea why you're here. You want something. And that's always a bad sign. Of course I do. Who better could I take it to? Out of that whole crazy crew from Atlantis, by some crazy coincidence, only you survived. How's that supposed to mean? Just thinking back. You miss the old times at all, Rogue? Fine with where they are, fine with where I am. I can see that. Shame no one else from the Atlantis had the same luck. Oh, yes, you is. Shish, what's the matter? Nothing. Your shift's done. You're heading home to kick your feet up. Okay. Guess I'm gonna go back to work. We'll have the whole place to ourselves? 
Hmm. VIP treatment. Now talk. Just what the hell are you insinuating? You chose a cozy life for yourself. I'm just curious what it cost you. We all pay a price for the choices we make. I'm no exception. That what you tell yourself when you're cashing corp checks? That's what I tell myself when I stand over the graves of the crew from the Atlantis. It's what I tell myself when I look at you now. Well, hey. The past is the past. That's right. But that's not why you're here. You want to drag me into something again, and this chatter is just a prelude. This body, I'm trying to... I'm not... Fuck. V's dying and I'm the fucking cancer killing him. But the process can be stopped. I just no, have to... No, Johnny. Don't start. Don't tell yourself you're out to help someone. It's only ever about you. So you can feel better. Oh, fuck off, princess. I'm running out of time, rogue. When that fucking clock strikes 12, Johnny will disappear and V will go with him. Need to get myself out of his head before that happens. We managed to contact Alt. She agreed to help. But? Only one place we can do it. A data fort. Makoshi. And the only access point we got a chance of reaching is tucked snugly under Saka Tower. Arasaka? Again? Should've seen that coming. Only an idiot does the same thing over and over, while expecting things to work out differently. You even have a plan for this? You're the best fixer in town. You tell me how we're gonna do this. Did you say we? That's right. Can't possibly work without you. So, what? I dust off and load up my tsunami? Rejoin your crusade against Arasaka? Bingo. When? Dunno. Now? Hmm. And what makes you think I'd agree? Cause I think you know you owe me one. Me and everybody else you buried while you climbed to the top. Shit. Knew this would happen one day. That one night, by some fucking miracle, you waltz in here and tear everything down. Some things never change. And us, have we changed? I don't know. Well, what do you say we go find out? Will you lend me a hand? Shut the fuck up, Johnny. Just stop talking. Fucking Christ. <laughs> every time. Every time. Never have I seen one not drunk as a pig sleep over 20 hours. I remember that face. Gotta be Crispin Wayland. Spit an image of your dad. Blood of the blood. But what did I miss? Why are you here? The boss will explain all. Rogue? There is only one boss. Let's go. The boss awaits.
see you two said your hellos. Excellent. Rogue, what's this specimen doing here? He's our pilot and our ride to Corpo Plaza today. Our ride? So you're in. Don't act all surprised, leadhead. Gears over there. Help yourself. Don't mind if I do. Johnny, you'll need gear. What are Take these? Retro thrusters. Antigravs. Strap them to your legs and you can jump from damn near any height. Christ, Johnny, I'm not your fucking babysitter. Never mind. Got it. Okay now, gonna tell me what the plan is. Yep. Jack in the shard. Targets the Mikoshi access point in Arasaka Tower. Need to reach the lab floor. Hold it just long enough to do what we need to do, then get out alive. Arasaka Tower's a fortress, the most secure building in Night City. Walking in through the front door just ain't an option. So, we'll get in through a window of our own making. Specifically, we fly in on a Militech Strix tactical bomber. First, we rain fire on the building's air defenses from a high altitude. Then we breach a wall on the 76th floor, jump from the AV, and survive the landing thanks to our anti -grabs. That's right. We'll land smack in the middle of a tropical rainforest. Contrary to popular opinion, Arasaka has panache at times. We cut our way through the jungle to a shaft located on the tower's vertical axis. The shaft runs the height of the building. We use our retro thrusts again. Reach the bottom floor quickly. We'll surprise the socks off security. They'll be in disarray. Resistance should be minimal. We hit the lab floor running, reach the access point. The rest will be in your hands. I'll hold for applause. As I said, there's only one boss, one queen. Saying we're gonna rain fire on these assholes. Seriously, I've waited too long for this. Don't bust out of your pants just yet. If we want to survive, we got to do a lot more. Here comes the tricky bit. We're going to knock a Jerujan 0401 ComSat off its orbit. Blood clot satellite. We're going to make history, friends. That'll freeze comms in NC, NorCal, and SoCal. Should buy us three or four hours. No coordination, no support, complete chaos. You mean to tell me that apart from that fucking bomber, you have a weaponized space shuttle? Got a certain... acquaintance at Orbital Air. Mystery benefactor? Highly positioned informant. I'll pay him enough to give us access to the Jerujan. The rest will be up to our old Netrunner friend. You mean Alt? Only one I know who can rip an Arasaka satellite out of the sky. I'm supposed to talk to Alt anyway. I'll convince her. Don't fuck this up, Johnny. It's the one thing I can't do for you. Said I'd do it and I will. So summing up, we fly to our socket tower unnoticed and say hello with a welcome basket of missiles. Exactly. Then we jump in, find the building's vertical axis, and work our way down. To the Mikoshi access point. Yep. What'd you think? Plan's got more gaping holes than a kabuki dollhouse. But fuck it, it's gotta work. It won't be the stupidest stunt we've ever pulled. Rogue? What? Just... thank you. Thank me later. There's still the matter of alt. Do you know how to move around cyberspace? Well, V got some practice under his belt. Sure I'll manage. Head out back. Nix will show you the ropes. And you, Wayland, heat up the Strix. We'll be with you soon. How long you gonna be? Might I have time for a nap? <laughs> hey, so you the one gonna dive, right? That is the plan. Right on. Hop into a suit. 
Then have a seat over there. I'm finishing up for the day. So you be resurfacing on your own. And don't fuck with my gear. So? Then why do I see her in front of me? You see Alt because you wish to. It's a defense mechanism. Your explicit memory is simply creating a replacement image. It's weird. Like Having I... a bad dream. You read my thoughts? An oversimplification. You still deny what you are. A construct. A set of data. I... Know you. You know me. Like lines of code. Well, this is all completely fucked. Now I feel... Naked. Time is short. Netwatch could detect our local net traffic. I know how we get it's to... It's beneath Arasaka Tower. Predictable. Holy fuck, you're doing it now. You're reading my- The Trojan 0401 poses no problem. I can deactivate the satellite. C -c can you just hold on a second? You will breach Arasaka Tower and locate the port into Mikoshi. This is the program that will establish the link. I will send it with you on a splinter. Upon your opening of a back door, I will be able to circumvent the data fort's security protocols. And then? You will be separated from V. And Mikoshi will cease to exist. Cease to exist, as will the constructs inside, right? No. The data constructs will not be destroyed. I intend to take them with me, to integrate them. Gonna devour them, those poor constructs. That's monstrous. You forget. They are data. Data that will not disappear, but become part of... something greater. Meaning what, exactly? It cannot be described in terms you will understand. But perhaps, one day, you will see it for yourself. Is that everything? That's all that crossed my mind. See you in Mikoshi. Yes. Yes. Right. works with Asukaga and Finch. Yeah, everything's fine. Got no reason to worry. Now, pull over. Kill the engine and have a nice long look at the stars. Simply that. You won't regret it. Gotta go. I love you. Ready? Yeah, it's ready. Good. Now come on, or that lunatic will take off without us. I like this joint. Gonna miss it.
to the very top. So, Wayland, what you tell him about the job exactly? Only what he wanted to know. His cut. He any good? Aiming to be an NC legend before long. Hmm, <laughs> aren't we all? Let me tell you, it'll be one loud morning. Time we gave this city another wake-up call. Jesus, it's so beautiful. About to get even prettier, too. The hell you say? You two take a puff at your chair with me? <laughs> I wish, Squama. Eyes on the sky, everybody. Cutting a mixer entrance in three, two... One. Whoa, was that the Jerusalem? Make a wish. Hey, they got a lock on us. Damn it. What do we do? Stick to the plan. Still breathing? Security personnel must report to designated zones. Wayland never jumped. Crashed by the waterfall. I'll try to reestablish contact with him, then find someone who's got access for the elevator going down. Wayland, you read me? How many pieces you in? Still one, I hope. And I think the local tribe's taken an interest in me. We'll get you out of there. Don't move. As if I could. We're going after Wayland. Can't open it from here. Probably a control term nearby. Oh. 
Open. Patching in alt. Let your woman out of her box. Look Let her show us what she's got. Here. Hey, you've always been the one. Know that, right? I do. Just a shame you never did. Well, could have been worse. Alt's in. Think she can break through the ice? I have bypassed security. I have complete control of the building. Not a clue. Nikoshi is clear. See those guys? Elevator. Now. Netrun Operations Control. 2067. An Arasaka bodyguard shields the Emperor of Japan from an assassin's bullet. 2071. Arasaka security forces prevent mass riots in San Francisco, saving the city from certain ruin. 2074. Bullshit. Know that look? Got something on your mind? Ever think back about why we did it? Did what? Why we took on the corpse, strapped in leather, chrome, and iron. Don't know, Johnny. We were young. Hot blood in our veins, shit judgment in our heads, like all pups. We fought for beauty, not knowing what was good or true. It was only the beautiful that meant a damn thing to us. Don't let your mind wander. We'll kick around old brain cells over vodka once we're done. My treater. Poor people with stories of the olden days, just like my grandparents. Arasaka Netrunners have stormed the tower's systems. Stopping their advance is my priority. Continue on your way alone. I've cleared a path, but you must hurry. An elite security unit is following you. Made a run for it. Wound up turret fodder. Holy fucking Christmas. Who is she? Oh shit. Seems Cunningham's made strides these last decades. Shit eaters never even stood a chance. Come on, the way down's beyond the door. Looks like our work here is already done. I'm preparing to repel a Netrunner attack originating from outside the facility. You will be on your own now. And you must hurry. An Arasaka elite force isn't far behind. Let's move it! Okay, so close, I can almost smell the data stream. Room past the partition. We cross it and we're at the core. Can't turn back time, Johnny. Ever. But you can always start over. Rogue. 
You were the best. Always. My father always said that had he a desert isle to go to, take him but one thing. He would take Rogue. Their generation made of a different metal. Hey, Wayland. Yeah, man. You're all right. Good luck, Silverman. The access point lies before you. Link to it, insert yourself, then search for me on the other side. Once out of nature, I shall never take my bodily form from any natural thing. But such a form as Grecian goldsmiths make, of hammered gold and gold enameling, to keep a drowsy emperor awake, or set upon a golden bough to sing to lords and ladies of Byzantium, of what is past, or passing, or to come. Hey, V. Happy to see me? Not exactly. Blacked out, then woke up here. I miss anything?
shame you couldn't watch. It was my magnum opus. You loved it. Mean yours and Rogue's, don't you? Rogue's dead. I'm sorry. Afraid things are pretty fucked for me too. Alt's hitting me with Soul Killer. My nerves are in shreds. You'll be all right. I mean, look, you made it this far. Awareness of what's happening right now. That just raunches. Like, Alt neatly packed me into an engram. Couldn't even tell when. Or how. So what do you think? Like being a clump of ones and zeros? At first, the phantom pain. Jesus. Felt like my whole body was on fire. Realize now it's not pain at all. It's just some digital simulacrum. Guess Alt's gonna start moving this digital psyche I am back into my flesh, but... Got no idea if I'll survive or what I'll be if I do. So we at the finish line? It's all in Alt's hands now? No. What the... Alt? I made a mistake in excluding the body as a factor. DNA reconfiguration has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons. Spit it out! In human terms! V will die independent of what I do. This is inevitable. This is imminent. For fuck's sake, Alt. You had one job and you fucked it up? I could not know the situation before conducting a thorough and precise diagnosis. You promised this poor little shit a new life! And you lied! You fucking lied! Johnny, shut it for two seconds, will you? Gotta think. Alt, come on. There's gotta be a way out of this. The biochip has irreversibly changed the host organism. It no longer belongs to V, who is an intruder there. The situation is different for you. All changes were made to accommodate you. Hang on. Telling your ex to kick me out of my own body? The changes are irreversible. You have nothing left to lose. He has everything to gain. I will not interfere in your personal affairs, but while Johnny has full control, he can do what he wishes. Alt, give us a What the hell for? So he can trick me into a green? Giving you a free pass, even though he can already do what you want with my body? You're my friend, V. I'd never pull that on you. Never do you wrong. If you're not ready to die, then... You're gonna live. You lied to me. From the start. So what do I do, Alt? Simply cross the bridge. V's life will be restored as it was before. You will become part of something greater. Listen, Johnny. I'm glad we met, got to know each other, and I'm sorry. I don't want to die. Who does? But I just don't see a way out. We'll find a way. No, Johnny. We won't. We're out of options. And I don't have the strength to keep fighting. Just 
promise me one thing, asshole? You won't forget me. Good morning, V. I trust you had a restful night. Mm -hmm. You have no new messages. You have one meeting planned today. At the afterlife, Delamain has confirmed a vehicle arrival at the arranged time. I've noticed your calendar is empty for what remains of the month. Would you like me to begin planning? No, thanks. That's as it should be. Perfect. Have a nice day. Hey, you there yet? Not yet. He'll be on time, though. His people came to scan the place earlier. Check and make sure everything's clean before he arrived. <laughs> Thought we didn't notice him. And the gear? All set with the heat. Rest, too. Full tank, ready to launch. Thanks. Be there soon. Hello. Thank you for choosing the Delamain service. Where shall we fly today? The afterlife. Head over there. As you wish. We will be traveling along restricted air corridors. No delays anticipated. Bream. If I may date, you look frightfully fatigued. Was it a difficult night? Difficult few weeks. I'm truly sorry to hear that. The Delamain Network is pleased to offer complimentary services that may just be the ideal remedy for your current condition. What's more, I'm delighted to inform you that Delamain has joined forces with Trauma Team. With our limited time only Safe Travels package, you have a full range of medical services available to you at your fingertips. Get me to the afterlife and floor it. Naturally. I've chosen the optimal route. We'll be arriving shortly. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy the stunning views of our fine city. Hmm. Might be the last time I get a look at this place. Do you plan to leave Night City? One way or another. In that case, I wish you a swift return home. This city, as certain of my clients note, is a true West Coast gem. They also call it 
a metropolis of near paralyzing beauty. Don't doubt it. Using the Delamain service. Have a nice day. Something's up. Won't be able to keep it under wraps much longer. Won't have to. Take offs today. Today? Is that a problem? No, no. Just in that case, you're gonna need something special. Rogue had this little ritual. Before any big op, she'd knock back a shot of tequila. Silverhand's preferred. Asked her once if it was for luck or whatever. You know what she said? Said it was about remembering. Said that remembering Johnny that way helped her focus on what was important. Anyways, afterlife tradition. I'm gonna mix you up one of our specials. Just tell me who we're drinking to. Mix me up a silver hand. Drinking to Johnny. I mean, I only know what people say about him, but Betty'd love what you're planning. Shit, you're with a damn moon. I know. Good luck, V. I've long awaited this moment, to look the latest afterlife legend in the eye. I must say, I'm moved. Happy not to disappoint. Sit, sit. Talk to me. Well, V, Mikoshi was quite the punch. You TKO'd Arasaka, in fact. Brought you eddies. Influence around town. But not just that. It meant positive paralysis of Arasaka systems. A few additional hatches opened up. My people rushed in, grabbed what they could. So it's all systems go for the op. I have confirmed the intel leaking out of Arasaka. The casino is currently testing a new security system. And it's true. They will be shutting it down briefly today. I believe you'll know how to use that moment. Won't be disappointed. Pick the best merc around for the job. So I've heard. But I'd like it proved to me as well. Speaking of which, nobody's ever pulled off a stunt like this. Where I'm from, they'd say it's straight impossible. They'd say you're taking too big a risk. 
poetically speaking, flying towards the sun to burn up. They'd be dead wrong. All of them. Self-confidence worthy of a legend. Or of someone risking it all. <laughs> but I sense you know what it's like to lose everything. To fight for one last breath. I see it in you. This time tomorrow, should have the casino's client data. All of it. Don't forget your side of the bargain. Oh, I never forget a promise. Good luck. Right. In position. Perfect. Almost to the second. My turn. Hmm. Satellites are down for now. Just got the signal. Signature cloaking activated. Remember, got one shot and one shot only. Yeah, tell me something I don't know. Soon as it starts, there'll be no backing down. No chance at extraction. No chance of survival if anyone notices. Excellent. But if this works, you'll gain more than you ever imagined. Times when I had something to gain are long gone. Now, now I got nothing to lose. That's kind of grim. Then again, who am I to judge? Okay. Here goes nothing. Good luck. See you down bottom. Over and out. What's up, kid? Been a while since you came to see old Vic. Uh, 
Let you choose if the afterlife found you a new Major League Ripper, huh? Them swanky downtown fuckers shooting chrome out his ass? Am I right? Ah, <sighs> well, I mean it, kid. Get all you can out of this life. You deserve it. More than anyone I know. But stop by sometime, okay? Next time you're in the neighborhood, we'll talk about old times and... I'll take a look at you, make sure that the new Ripper of yours didn't screw anything up. See you around, V. Hey, V. Everyone's telling me you're a base gordo now. A big shot, eh? <laughs> so big you can't call me once a week. Once a month, even. Don't forget where you started. Who'd you started with, hmm? My door's always open to you, V. There's always food on my table. Mi casa es su casa. No se te olvide. Ahí te veo, V. Hey, V. Long time no see. Let me guess, you still the top of your game in all of Night City? <laughs> yeah, I left all that. I guess I'm just calling to say thanks. For everything. It wasn't until I'd left everything behind that I realized how depressed I was for all that time. Take it from me, V. If you ever get the chance, just leave. Leave and don't look back. The weight it takes off your shoulders, I... I can't even describe it. All right, enough lecturing. Take it easy, man. Hello, V. How are things? Weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you for all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Alda Caldo. Remember that. Ah, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. So, funny thing just said. Oh, fuck, fuck, sake. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. What did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on a tour with them? At first, I was like, over oh, my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, I don't know what else. Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. 
Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out. B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Before samurai committed to seppuku, they wrote Jisei, a death poem. It contained their final thoughts about life, about death. I have read many of them of late. Some are truly works of beauty. Yet, I am not a samurai, so I bid you farewell with simple words. Rot in hell, Xero. Hey, it's Peralez. B, you're gonna want to hear this. But first, we need to go somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She, she keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at a lab, and they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, 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 when you got a sec, call me, okay? Oh yeah, and don't forget to delete this message. V? Listen, I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot. I know, I know the reading's not as strong without you here, but we haven't seen each other for so long, and I... Well, one thing led to another. Know what I drew? Strength, the Emperor, and the world. Babe, the world's gonna hear about you. Go and show Night City what you're made of. <laughs> 